हेलो स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज अ वेरी क्रिशियल टाइम फॉर ऑल ऑफ अस बिकॉज ऑफ करोना वी ऑल आर स्टेइंग एट होम बट यू आर इन क्लास ट्वेल्व एंड यू हैव नो टाइम टू वेस्ट सो एज अ मेंटर ऑफ योर्स आई रंजना अग्रवाल इज गोइंग टू कंटिन्यू योर स्टडीज विद द हेल्प ऑफ ऑनलाइन क्लासेस दिस इज माई फर्स्ट वीडियो एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई विल टेल यू अबाउट द मार्किंग स्कीम ऑफ योर सब्जेक्ट इंग्लिश your question paper will be of 80 marks and these 80 marks are divided into three sections first section is section a that is reading section reading section is of 20 marks and for these 20 marks you will get two questions question number 1 is unseen passage and this unseen passage is of 12 marks and question number 2 is note making and this note making is of 8 marks how can you get good marks in reading section this will be discussed in the upcoming videos and now we will come to the section b that is writing skill this section is of 30 marks and these 30 marks are divided into four questions question number 3 is short composition that is of four marks and for these four marks you have to prepare four topics the topics are advertisement notice poster invitations and its replies now question number 4 is letter letter is of 6 marks and for these 6 marks you have to prepare 6 types of letters at least these all are official letters and the name of the different types of letters are business letter inquiry letter complaining letter letter to editor school application and job application now we are coming to question number 5 and question number 6 these two questions are long composition and both the questions are of 10 marks each it means you will get 20 marks with these two questions for getting 20 marks you have to prepare four different topics of long composition that are article debate speech and a report long composition means a writing composition which is of at least 200 to 250 words now next section is literature literature is also of 30 marks and for these 30 marks you will get four questions question number 7 is comprehensive question and answers in this section you will get two questions and you have no choice in all these two comprehensive questions one comprehensive can be from poetry and the another can be of prose so four four marks for both the comprehensive questions now question number 8 question number 8 is short answer type questions and you will get seven questions out of seven you have to attempt only five questions and for attempting five questions you will get 10 marks and these questions can come from either prose or poetry anything question number 9 question number 9 is a long answer type question and this is of six marks question and for this six marks you have to prepare long answer questions from your book flamingo question number 10 last is also of long answer type question and for this you will get 6 marks and these 6 marks you can get by reading long questions from your book vistas that is all about your uh, marking scheme and uh, in i want to tell you students that in my next video first i will tell you ki what should be done to get good marks in the examination of english thank you have a nice day